What up, y'all? What's happening? Listen, got something on my mind. I've been um, meaning to talk to y'all for a couple weeks. So I guess I'll share with you now. Um, you know that phrase that we've all heard over and over and over again. That phrase that says, we're living in the last days, right? We've heard this phrase so many times. I'm talking about from our children to us, our parents and their parents. Like for generations and generations, everybody I've heard this phrase, we're living in the last days. We've heard this phrase so much that we've become desensitized to it. Don't really mean nothing to us no more. You know what I mean? Like people hear it now and be like, whatever. I've been hearing that ever since I was a child. And no matter what generation you go to, we all can say that. We've been hearing that since we was a child. Well, I feel like God has been putting on my heart to tell you guys to change your perspective, right? Because indeed, we are living in the last days. And no, it might not be, we, not, we might not live to see the time where the Lord crack open the sky and Christ come back and destroy the earth like he did in the days of Noah. You might not live to see that. I might not live to see that, but guess what? We're still living in the last days because he's coming back every day for somebody. He came back today. He came back yesterday for somebody. He's coming back today for somebody else. You know what I mean? Every day, each and every last one of us could be living our last days. So if we can just tweak our perspective just a little bit and don't take this life for granted, and 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 when you hear that phrase, not be so desensitized to it and go along with your life like whatever. I've been hearing that forever. It's never going to happen. But guess what? Somebody died last night. Somebody died this morning. Somebody probably going to die tonight. And, and, and Lord is coming for them. You know what I mean? So in a sense, yeah, we are living in our last days. You know, we might not go all up at once. As a human race and all experience this destruction of earth like uh like like scripture, which is gonna happen, but we not we might not be here to witness it. People are getting taken up every day. Life is precious, life is short, and you are living in your last days. So I I I really I really uh, encourage you guys to live as you are. Don't take this life for granted and treat people how you want to be treated and love them and, and have that relationship with the father that he wants with you, you know, because tomorrow is not promised. I'm sure that uh, everybody who dies has some kind of plan that they wanted to get accomplished for that day, for their future, that they never saw they they never seen uh come to pass. So I just want to put that on your mind, man. Change your perspective a little bit and 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 realize that tomorrow really isn't promised. And the Lord comes. He comes every day. He comes like a thief in the night. And no man, no man knows the day or the hour. So with that said, 100 man, y'all uh don't take life for granted. Love y'all and Peace. One.